Johnny Breyer, the first African-American referee in NFL history, has passed away. He was 74. Breyer was born April 16, 1947, in Charlotte, North Carolina. He was the son of a construction worker and a homemaker. His family later moved to Washington, D.C., where Greyer got his start refereeing basketball scrimmages when he was just a student at Dunbar High School. He turned that into a career as a high school and college football official. The NFL hired him in 1981 as one of nine African-American officials in the league. While all football officials are sometimes called referees, the truth is that each of the officials have different duties and titles, the referee being the leader of the crew and the only one to wear a white hat. Grier worked NFL games for 23 years, from 1981 to 2004, beginning as a field judge before being promoted to referee in 1988. His final game as a field judge was Super Bowl XXII, which saw Doug Williams become the first African-American starting quarterback to win the Super Bowl. Grier followed in the footsteps of Burl Toller, who was the first African-American official in the NFL to serve as a field judge and head linesman from 1965 to 1989. Thanks for watching! Subscribe to stay in the know for other celebrity tributes.